hit the allies. In fact, you can put arms on the table. So if you cut off more arms, you can get uh, a very fun weapon. But that's besides the point. I'm at 50 mine, that's fine. Bone so I could do a merge. Okay, another white vial, which is pretty nifty. Uh, let's add some blood. And now we're gonna get a husk, just like before. Human husk is fully grown. It's kind of useless, though. Oil. Blue herb. Studies of Sylvian. Natural doctrine. Extra resources. Another pipe. That's whatever. Tomato. And welcome to the Temple of Torment in the past. Some soul stone, and we have. Um, so we can explore now, which is not a big deal. Oh no, not the spider! Kill it in a single hit, or just step on it, and it's all okay. Just get the uh, things now. Scrolls, any scrolls in chat? Oh, there is one, and it's okay. Mm hmm, I see. I am very sad about this. I would have preferred to get something cooler. Anything here? Nope. And this one should have something, yeah. Three silver coins, cool, cool. Pine cone, oil, dust, glass vial, chest. What can you find in the chest? Dirt. Kinda useless. Since we are on this side, let's get tinder boxes, let's get another white vial, a bottle of whiskey, good, another white vial, and let's pick up this soul stone. And to the past we go. And before chamber, I will set up, obviously. Okay, so here. Here. I already checked all the, all the urns that I need. Sacrifice room. The husk wanders in. Let's sacrifice it. And let's hope that Chambara doesn't instantly collide for me. Okay, never mind. That's rude. Oh, okay, cool. If I remember correctly, you can just run from this fight uh, without any big deal, without any issues, so... Yeah. Okay, thank you for wandering off. I really appreciate it. Okay. Now we are done. Let's juke. And let's head out.
Okay, so let's stand here and let's start setting up. So we will gonna need mind. Uh, let's use ale for this. Dars doesn't really need it, but that's fine. Uh, let's heal up. Moonless and Dars. Then use. Oh, I've used up all my ale. That's fine. I can still like smoke. Let's smoke opium. And now let's give meat to everyone. Oh, I didn't even need to use the salami. Okay, just in case I don't like randomly walk into a mind event and. Uh, into a hunger event and just, you know, lose everything that I need. And here we're gonna do Salmon Snake on Ragnavalder, just so I can avoid losing more limbs. Uh, Ring of Raves on here. It can be ever watching, it's fine. Stone Crown for extra protection. Leather helmet. And I think that's as much as I can do. And we should be good to go. Let's fight. Something rising from the pool of blood. Mm. I think the idea is we're gonna start with Throwing darts into the top zone. Legard will use the lantern, hopefully. And Dars will set up. Apply the dots for the fight to go over faster. Okay, no fire. That's pretty annoying, but it's not the biggest deal. And with Dars, let's attack the arm. Okay, I'm taking quite a bit of damage because of my... Oh, I missed. Oh, I triggered. Okay, I accidentally triggered the second phase. That's not good. The upside is that it's still poisoned. No. Okay, I'm alive at least. Jump the wheel. And. Since I am. Um, actually, no, I can still go for jamming the third circle. That's a miss, but that's not jammed. I will use this opportunity to heal myself and then attack the middle one. I don't remember if the state is applied already or not, but okay, it's not. That's not good. Okay, okay, at least it didn't hit Ragnarok, which was important. The revolution tower. Okay, didn't it? Okay, interesting. Did it just not jump or what? Um, a little buggy if you can see. Let's just attack the circle. Yeah, that one's jumped. Okay, chains of the guard. Okay, bleeding is fine. Okay, now it's vulnerable, finally. So now an extra attack is just go for the torso. Okay, broken bones, annoying. But the fight should be over very soon. Since the poison just, you know... Should have dealt most of the damage already. Okay, at 
it wasn't. Oh, nice crit. Okay, so the guard has worms. We're gonna deal with that, that's fine. Yay! Tormented soul. Yippee. Um... I need to double check something before we go for... Uh... So worms we can cure by... Oh, do I have to clear everything? Bra. Uh... So worms and bleeding can be cleared by using the salmon snake, so... Which is pretty fun. Uh, let's put up Ring of Raves back. And let's put up some Snake Soul. And the rest is fine. Uh, maybe let's heal since I have the option. I'm not expecting to lose much from doing the angel, but you know. You never know. Uh, is it time to use an elixir? I don't think so. Actually, I have five. I might as well. This is fine. So now that we've dealt with... Okay, good luck. Um... Now that we have dealt with this, double check the hunger, it's fine, we are not gonna get randomly destroyed, I think. And the trick is to just have everyone use black orb on the heart and hope it dies. Yep. There it is. Use the soul stone. And this is going to go on Legard. White Angel Soul. Mm -hmm. I think I checked this already, so yeah. So that's that. So the marriage that we fought was NQ with someone else. And I want to double check, because I'm not sure right now, uh, if, if even if Enki goes for a marriage, if you can get the required soul from him. Oh, I didn't really need, need to go through there. Um, might as well go back. And just teleport and check. Oh, you're standing there, you cheeky bugger. You cheeky bugger. Uh, I don't remember if the Hall of the Gods is available if you go through the past. Yeah, you can. Yay, we're gonna ask questions. I just want an extra save, thank you. Uh, last time I asked about the girl, about Legard, and about Dars, but I think I messed up how I spoke about them, so let's talk about Enki this time. Notorious Dark Priests of the Modern Age. Yeah, New Enlightened One. Um, what subject do you want to know more about? Let's ask about Moonless. A lone cave wolf who was once driven away from her pack because of her superior strength. The black has its way of changing the nature of wolves. And let's ask one about... Uh, who should I ask about? Shambara. Shambara. Aaron Shambara, when he was when he still walked among men as a mere mortal. Once a poet he believed no great art can be achieved without pain and suffering. He now continues the same principle as a new god. 
Thank you. You get Book of Enlightenment. That was the only reason for us to come there. Lore is funny, but you know. Uh, sometimes you just want some gameplay things. I should have... Let me double check, because I think I have... Okay, yeah, I have two soul stones. So let's double check that... Uh, this. Can I use a soul stone? I can. The question is what is... Yes, it is enlightened soul. Okay, so... This allows you to skip the fight with... Uh, mm, what's his name? With... Uh, with the big head, Valtail. We are still going to explore his uh, his area because of because of a few items that are there that I would like to double check. But still, that's good that if if there is a marriage there, it still can work. Because you need to have all of those souls for to enter and. As it turns out that the the heroes have the same souls in them as you, so we are going to explore a little bit here. I'll go. Why do I keep getting volume one? I don't want volume one. Just double checking, you know. We are just not I will do the puzzle I think as well. Because the puzzles uh, there are still a few books you can find in the... Uh, in there as well, so it might worth, be worth checking out what is it, what there is. Okay, I guess I'm not winning coin flips this time around. Nothing left here. Uh, I don't remember the puzzle right now. I think this one was like this, this one was like this. This one was like this, and this one... Yeah. Hey, would you look at that? I remember something sometimes. We will, we will not be fighting the boss, we are just here to plunder the library a bit. You know, we are like Britain in, uh, like, during, during their history. We'll just be checking out some areas here, because I don't remember which one has what we need. Studies, and there is a soul stone and a coin flip. Maybe we can get something cool. Passages of Mahabra. That does not help at all. Just below those ladders. And just below those ladders we are not going to bother. Passages have... some use for me. Well, one of them is we can get some extra loot. Uh, the other one is we can just teleport away from uh, the blue scene. And picking up a blue scene here might be a valid strategy just to, you know, pick up some of the stuff for Dar, like give, give Dar some extra, uh, extra manpower, I guess. Or rather, like, you know, uh, damage at least. So that's that, so we only need the uh, Soul of the Endless, and we can do it in another way. Which I think I'm going to, actually. Do. So Kakara is still in the prisons, as you may know. And uh, uh, let's just say that Kahara is called in a very pe peculiar way. And we're going to abuse that fact. Resources are good. 
So we're gonna go save Kahara. And by safe I mean brutally murder them, but you know, that's how it is sometimes. Uh, there is still the... Oh yeah, this guy. We can dodge, right? Yeah, we can. Okay, that's fine. Also, I'm starting to feel hungry. But that's fine. Oh, not here. Uh, I meant to go here. Use the cell keys, sup. Attack him. You're gonna regret this. Oh, will I? Prepare yourself. Um, I did not fight this fight. I'm gonna be honest. But my guess is to just, you know, take out the sword and black orb the head. Kinda, kinda obvious. Yep, that was easy. So, soulstone first. Then search. Eh, leather vest. Surprisingly, I can't eat the corpse, which is interesting, but... Now we have enlightened and less tormented. Which means that we can uh, go challenge the nameless figurine. Without having to fight two of the gods. I wouldn't have to fight more, but I'm playing as uh, Ragnavalder, so we kinda we kinda have to, I guess. Uh, since I'm here, I might as well heal up Moonless a little bit, you know. She's doing her best. And let's... Let's... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Elixir of mine, but I think I can just smoke... I have a lot of tobacco, so let's do tobacco. It heals more mind, but, you know, uh, anything is better than nothing. And now, just dodge this fella, because we don't need to fight him. Go through here. I'm just gonna check how many soul stones have I activated, actually, and can use, but... I don't think it's mm, that many. Use the hexen. Okay, yeah, I have zero. There isn't anything that I'm interested in picking up. Maybe pyromancy trick and maybe healing whispers. Or I can learn, actually, greater blood magic might be good. Because it lets you uh, get some good skills, so let's get that out of the way as well. And to be clear, I will still go to the dream, because there are a few things I can get, including a empty scroll, which will be useful. But you never know. And greater blood magic. That's simple. And if I remember correctly, this also lets me... I think it also reduces the cost of uh, Black Orb, but I don't remember if that's the case or not. It, it doesn't matter. So we still have simple transmutation, but I don't need to do anything with it now. I can get a purple wire, vial, which doesn't help either. And I can also make murky vial, which is great, and I will actually do it. Because it's basically AoE uh, burn. How many torches do we have? I'm sensing zero, but... Okay, we have definitely have zero, so... No, not here. Uh, for the next part... Oh, also, yeah. Scoop it in a glass vial. And 
we're gonna craft a, a few murky vials because they are very useful. And I don't think there is a uh, reason to use oil, so... Five murky vials should be good enough. We can also explore that area as well if we want to, but... Uh, Tower of the Endless... And while we're here, I'm gonna save because this run has been going on for a while. And I would prefer to get... Uh, okay, so let's first of all manage the hunger a little bit. I don't need to blue vial anyone. Um, Moonless's mine doesn't matter. Let's keep one moldy bread because in case I would need to do the Jesus loop. And let's save. And we're gonna save in the next slot. And now... We're gonna head out. Go through the dreamscape. Oh, there's also one more thing we can do that's here. Kind of misplay. Total misplay. We can go through here. And there is body of Jean lying here. Get plate mail, long sword and two blue vials. And I think somewhere around here you can get... Oh, okay, I don't have torches, oops. So let's craft 11, sure. Yeah, that's fine. I should have probably just crafted one. We can get another lucky coin here and the extra tinder box here. So we're gonna head out to the dream as we said, as I said. And in the dream we will get all the things that we need, just, you know, more setting up for the final fight and we can go challenge the nameless figurine. Tear the cloth and rest. And now we shall experience turbulent dreams. Uh, let's fix that. Welcome to Rondon again. I'm gonna have to mute one area of the game as again. But still, more things you can get. Just don't get caught yet. Because I will want to get caught later. Okay. I'm gonna go in. Uh, we. Yeah, if you are wondering about the uh, fast text, uh, if you hold page down, you can skip through the text pretty quickly. Which is a trick I've learned a while ago. Scroll of Fever? Well, that's kinda... Well, it's not useless. 
but it's not useful either. Hey, Enki. I killed you before, so I don't care. Actually, I might just well keep skipping this. Yeah, yeah, whatever. I, I simply do not care. Now we can go. Oh, oops! I didn't pay attention for a second there. That's my bad. So we're gonna head back. Sup nerd? Sup nerd? Can I? Can I walk past? Thank you. So we already talked to Almir. Almir. Okay, so here are the fellas. Priest robe. Talk to this one. Empty scroll. Thank you. Get back into the plate mail. And now if we head uh, here, up here, there are a few more things you can pick up. Explosive vial, cheese, powder, and I don't think there is anything else here, so you're gonna head here. We are seeing Ragnarvalder's backstory that we are already playing as, so that's fun. Uh, let's skip this. I already talked about this in my previous playthrough, so I'm not going to, uh, you know, think about it too much. Okay, now we should be able to move. And there are a few things I want to pick up before the dogs get me. And afterwards I will just, you know, ignore the rest. Torch died down, that's okay. What's up? No, they got murdered. And here is barrel, nothing worthwhile, and the leather helmet. And now we can just, you know, stroll around a little bit. Where are the dogs? Um, game. Are you not going to send dogs for me? Are you real? Do I have to fight now? Uh, I was hoping I would avoid this. God dang it. This is literally just an unneeded fight that I can take. Do the dogs disappear after you find the correct place? Or do they just like, I don't know. Can I fall down the well or something? Can't interact with anything else. Well, that's not good. Okay, fine. I would have preferred to not fight, but I guess since uh, since the dogs are not gonna show up, I might as well. Uh, that was not useful useful at all. So. Oopsie. Okay, the setup is going to be very simple. Salmon snake on me. Extra turn here. The rest doesn't matter. Uh, pick up my mind up a bit because otherwise it's going to be a little bit annoying. Uh, and just double check. 
We still have uh, murky vials, so murky vials will be the 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 setup for this time for this fight. Can I just leave? Will the dogs show up now or? I guess not. A fight it is then. Yeah, let's go. Hello there, old lady. You got the ominous vibes from the lady in the darkness. And for this we're gonna do... Orange Vial. I don't remember if the poison works here, but we can test. Darts here and fast attack. Oh, poison works? I think it's removed between turns though. But we can see. Yeah, it is removed. But now I can do... Where is it? Merky Vial, all enemies. Uh... Merky Vial. And I think this should be enough to deal with most of the body parts. Okay, only one. That's good enough. Uh, so let's start dealing with the arms. Okay, that one's gone. That one is not gone yet. Rod. Oh, critical slash. Okay, it's fine. This one is out as well. Uh, deal with this and then it's fine. Oh, that one has a lot of health for whatever reason. Okay, she can't use face rip, so now it's just time to, to punch. Easy, okay. Not a big deal. I did take a bleeding, but that's fine. We're gonna skip through that because we don't care. I kinda wanna know what happens if you say no to Nilvan. I already have the soul, so I do not care. I kinda haven't seen what the reaction is to like taking to the heart of darkness. Take, take the child to the heart of darkness. Sorry, the child is already dead. But you wouldn't know it. Because you're kinda bad. And stupid. And here is Nilvan. Sup? I refuse. Doesn't seem pleased with this decision. Okay, she just... okay. You wake up from your dream. Okay, worms as well. It's fine. All you need. Oh, I have two rings of raves. Interesting. There's a little bit of salmon snake soul and then... You can get Ring of Raves just to get healing up. And I'll be taking the soul back. Ah, lag. Can you please stop lagging? Please. Let's go to the main gate. Uh, I didn't take that much damage, so it doesn't matter. Scene, but I don't know if I want to waste more time right now. 
I think I will have to set up before the. Uh, what's it? What's its face? Uh, I will have to set up before uh, going to the gauntlet because gauntlet is an awful place and I it, it's so easy to die there and I hate it please stop going for the arm it's almost dead Dars please Also, I don't know how stone can bleed, but I guess it's some sort of a golem, maybe? And we don't even need to fight Francois on this run. There is no reason for us to do that. So let's talk to him. Let's leave. And, just so I don't run into something, while the dogs will be chasing me. Okay, the dogs don't follow you. And you can cut this open. And, the gauntlet is open. And that's... Interesting, I guess. So now we can do a set, we can start setting up for the real challenge. I think I'm gonna do Gauntlet as a separate episode because it's it's such an awful place where you can fail so hard and I hate it. Oh, I don't even need to buy that purifying talisman, huh? Eyeglasses, that's also not that helpful. So that's that. Um, so now let's do the settings. Since we are already uh, done with everything. Let me double check. We have two books of enlightenment, one empty scroll. Which I don't know if I need for anything right now. Oh, I forgot there is a harvest man if you go through here. Oops. Uh, let's head the other way then. I don't wanna meet that fellow. We're instead gonna go through the lower entrance. So we skipped one boss. I didn't have to fight one, but it's whatever. I didn't have to fight like the the the, the, the last boss, but eh. it's okay. It's all right. Um, keep up the depths. Let's, let's go. Let's go through here. And now let's head back to um good question where so this is on level six uh that weird funny looking thing that we saw before so i think that before that we would prefer to do some setups and loops and stuff like that. Let's ignore the night, we kind of don't care about it. I'm gonna do the Jesus loop a bit. Thank you. 
Okay, I think this should be good enough. So, we got ourselves a 12 wine vials. And we have a way to get a deal with hunger, so it's not a big deal. I will start using up some of my stuff that I have already. Turnip restores only seven. That's kind of sad. How about a tomato? Okay, that's also seven. Yeah, let's keep up the shape of us and light up the torsion. Let's go. So we got the Jesus loop done. Uh, this means that we should be good on mind restoring items for now. We will have to go back uh, to the Grand Library and talk with a certain fellow that is called a wizard because uh, there are some items that I would prefer to have before we head out further. Yes, this way. Go through here. Uh, is the harvest one here? Yeah, it's walking. It's walking. But we do not care about it. Okay, so how much? 25 only? Damn, I didn't find any more coins. Mm, because I was considering maybe going for the Sorcerer's Stone. We, we still can, but that means I have to go here. I guess the Harvestman got tired and is now going to stand there, because why not? And instead we're gonna go back to the present. Uh, not here, oops. I mean, technically I could have gone through the library, it doesn't change anything. I can't, but I don't want to fight with embryos, so... That's gonna be for later. So let's head out. Through here. Through here. Through here. So if we go through here, there is a black witch that will attack us. But it doesn't matter. You can also just, you know, ignore her. See if there is something here that we might also want to find before we head out. Since Gauntlet is a place of no return, you know, uh, it's better to just prepare before that. It's kind of the same situation as with the Void, so... There is also a fella here, as you can see. Okay, two empty scrolls, that's decent. Studies of Gregorov, doesn't matter. Please. Please, I am not interested. I am neither interested here. 
I am interested in this though. So if you kept Isaiah alive in both maps from him, uh, he would appear here, he would attack you, give you the map to the third fan, to the third one, but right now we just want the coins, so you know. Not a big deal. Uh, I don't need the witch for anything either, so or the witch soul, so And now let's get actually yeah, let's get the blue scene. Let's get blue scene, let's get a level with Grogorov as well. You know, might as well since we'll be in the area. We can also get uh, some item that items that give resistance to magical attacks. Which I think don't matter against Grogorov specifically, but it's whatever. So we're gonna head through here. Climb down. We're gonna talk to the mask. We are gonna partake in the feast. Which will reduce our hunger to, to one. And will give us another level of affinity with Gragorov, which is very cool. Remember to not try this at home, kids. Uh, we're gonna go through here. And here's Blue Sin. We're gonna take it. And now, just before this collapses, and Book of Enlightenment, that would be stupid. Where is it? Passages of Mahatra. In before the area collapses, we can go through here. And what's fun, if you have killed some of the gods, they won't appear in here. The tormented one is nowhere to be seen. <laughs> Francois acknowledges this with a slight nod and a smirk. Yeah, I already... Uh, let's say I already made them meet with their... Uh, meet their uh, partial end, because for whatever reason... Ron Chambara uh, is alive in the second uh, in the second game, which I always found interesting. Somehow he's like I think the only new god that does survive, which I always found fascinating. Fun fact: if you there is a bug in the in the game here that if you go in a very specific place you can head get back up to the uh, to the upper level here oh soul devour necklace that's fine leather helmet pipe yeah I'm starting to fade I think if you go yeah if you go right like this you can you can head back here but uh, we are not we are not gonna glitch ourselves out it's not worth it, I think at least. We're just gonna grab some extra stuff here. I found an iron maze. Okay, excellent. So everything collapsed. Instead of a long sword, we're gonna grab a blue scene, which is 125 attack. A short or long sword here and this should be good now we're gonna go through the caves and get Jinga Sakabuto and uh, Eastern Silk Robes and Charm of Yegaigetsu now we're gonna open this passage, which will lead to the deeper thicket, which I now need to maneuver through again. Uh, 
but it's okay. And we're back to level 7. So we did what we needed. I think most of the setup is done already, so that's great. Uh, we still don't need to fight them. I will heal up Dars though. And if, oh yeah, and we also should go back to uh, Okay, I'm not going to use torches here because I feel like I need to uh, preserve them for the gauntlet. We're gonna head back to the wizard and we will get from the wizard an item that will restore my mind in combat and Oh, never mind. I for forgot it's dark in here. And we are also going to get some a bunch of elixirs for the for the end game. But we have to go to the past for this. And we have to meet up with our good friend Harvestman that we will promptly ignore. At least I hope so. Yeah, he just chillin' like that. So, we have 99 coins, we're gonna get Sorcerer's Stone, we're gonna get... Elixir of Mind... Elixir of Body... I think Elixir of Mind is currently more valuable because uh, of healing that we have. And let's go! Let's finally head back to where we need to go. Uh, so back to the past, to level 5, through the cave dweller village. Let me double check, because I don't think I have soul stones, right? Yeah, I have no soul stones, okay. So I can't really learn anything. Which is a bit of a shame, but you know. It's fine. Level 5. And we are heading to the Heart of Darkness. Right through here. We are gonna ignore the knight, because the knight didn't do anything to us. He did try to attack us though, but I can forgive that. Uh, let's head through here. There is, should be still one, yeah. One fella here. This one is dead. Oh, while we're here... Skin. Uh, I don't know if I have the crafting. I have, okay. There should be one more guard I can skin before we do this. Without having to fight this one. Because I don't want to deal with that one either. If I'm not mistaken, I fought a guard in the prisons. Did I? I don't remember. And if not, I can just, you know, uh, head through. I need to double check because I, li I literally don't remember. I thought I did fight a guard on this run. Or on this save, rather. But I genuinely do not remember. Uh, let's head to the entrance. Okay, so this guard is alive. So let's fight it.
We're gonna deal with it in a simple way. Okay, that's all the all she wrote. Yeah, that was easy. And we're gonna skin this one. And we can craft a guard outfit, which will help us move through the through the gauntlet. It's not necessary to to do, but it eases the pain of that of that journey. So you know, might as well. Double checking how many torches do I have? Six. Okay, excellent. This should be enough to, to go through the gauntlet. Yeah, the torch died down, doesn't matter. I don't remember if I checked this. I did. No, I didn't. White violent cabbage, okay. Through the dark hut, light the torch inside because I don't remember how to move through this. We are back here. I already checked the other areas. And as you can see, this is now open. And you know what that means? We are going to climb down. You can you can climb back up, but once you climb down, 